It's Atim Gamer, and we're back with another video. And today's video is on Minecraft Story Mode. So, um, in this video, I'm just gonna be talking over stuff sometimes, but most of the video, you're gonna hear the characters talking. So, just head straight to this now. So, yeah, I'll, I'll pick my character. Oh my god, this guy! So, yeah, he looks the most like me anyway. So, come on. Okay, start episode one. No, I'm not gonna talk now whatsoever. It will talk by itself. The game series adapts to the choices you make. The story Nothing is... Nothing built can last forever. And every legend, no matter how great, fades with time. I got it. With each passing year, more and more details are lost until all that remains are myths, half-truths. To put it singly, lies. And yet, in all the known universe, between here and the farmlands, the legend of the Order of the Stone endures, unabridged as self-evident fact. Indeed, it is only a troubled land that has need for heroes, and ours was fortunate to have, so long ago, four heroes such as these. Gabriel, the warrior, before whose sword all combatants would tremble, Eligard, the redstone engineer, whose machines would spark an era of invention. Magnus the Rogue, who would channel his destructive creativity for the benefit of all. And Soren, the architect, builder of worlds, and leader of the Order of the Stone. These four friends together would give so much to gain their rightful place as four heroes. Their greatest quest would take them on a dangerous journey to fight a mysterious creature known as the Ender Dragon. In the end, the Order of the Stone emerged victorious and the dragon was defeated. Their story complete, they slipped away into the pages of legend. Okay, well, that was long. But when one story ends, another one begins. Would you rather fight a hundred chicken-sized zombies or ten zombie-sized chickens? Yeah. Just to be clear, you wouldn't have any weapons or armor. Huh? Huh? What? It's just a dumb question. Forget it. So, I've got a daylight sensor on the roof. And if I did this right, these lamps should turn on once it gets dark. Mm -hmm. I didn't want to just leave Ruben here with nothing while we're at the building competition. He's coming with us. Really? <laughs> what kind of question is that? Of course he okay. is. Okay, I'm not saying he shouldn't come. I'm not. But don't you think it's a little weird to be taken with you everywhere you go? He kind of makes us look like, I don't know, amateurs. didn't mean anything by it. I'm glad he's coming. I just don't want to give people one more reason to call us losers. I'm getting tired of it. Who cares what other people think? I know. I'm just... It wears you down. You say you're not a loser, Olivia. So win. Okay. Fine. Yeah, 
So yeah guys, as you could see it switches sometimes, so I'm just gonna see what I like choose, you're not gonna like, I'm not gonna talk over them, so yeah, come on, hold R2 to hold How do you scream like that? Oh, it does, it just still old enough. So this, this. Maybe. Maybe. Shears definitely taking these. Never know what I might need to shear some sheep. One of these days, we're gonna win the Endercon building competition. And when we do, people will look at us and say, hey, there goes Jesse and Ruben, winners of the Endercon building competition. Maybe we should change the name. Okay, and we have an armor stand. This stand is a gift, but don't have any armor to put on it. Maybe someday. And finally, I think... Give me a the... dragon roar, Reuben. That'll do, Reuben. That'll do. Okay, let's get down now.
god, this is really cool. Come on. Punch all the flowers. Let's share some shit. When a gamer comes to check the time, it's still. Oh, great. There's Lucas and the Ocelots. The rivalry continues. Man, they've got matching leather jackets and everything. So cool. Well, well, well. If it isn't the order of the losers. <laughs> great. The fail squad's here. Lucas, get a load of these losers. Let's go, guys. We're building a mobs, so we need... So much for losing anonymously. Yeah, they didn't. Whoa. Sounds like a name for pirates, guys. It's cool. Okay, dead enders. You guys are in booth five. Come on. Okay, booth five. Let's ignore all of this and go straight to booth 5. Is that a freaking beacon? They have a freaking beacon? Freaking beacon? That's stained glass. They aren't just building a beacon. They're building a rainbow beacon. That is very cool. We're gonna lose. Our design is way cooler. A gigantic zombie is, is way cooler than a fancy light. Their difficulty score is going to be higher than our total score. Um, We've got some very good fireworks. We should probably stop staring at them. Ha ha ha. Look, it's the only the losers again. <laughs> good one, Gil. We're just looking. There'll be plenty of time for you all to look at it after it wins and gets shown at Endercon. You're being unpleasant. Maybe not all of you. Endercon doesn't allow outside food or drink. I'm talking about your pig. Shut up. What's that? Jesse said, shut up. Do you need to hear it again? I don't know. Maybe. Stop wasting your time, Aiden. We've got work to do. You're lucky I'm busy. Hey, Jesse. Guys. Hey, Petra. How's Bill going? Only time will tell, but we're optimistic. Hey, Petra, I forgot to thank you for that nether star. Hey, Lucas, not a problem. You help these tools? For the right price, I'll help anyone. If you need anything, you know where to find me. None of us know where to find you. Exactly. Don't hurt feelings, guys. If you're cool with Petra, you're cool with us. So why don't we just forget about all this and, you know, Make this about how cool our builds are. We're cool with Petra, but you need to teach your friend some manners. He's just trying to get in your head. Well, have you heard the set? So, guys, I'm going to end the video here because I don't have time. So, thank you so much for watching this video. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And I shall see you all next time. Goodbye.